Hi, Gemini. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. For a personal reading, please visit my website. All the information is in the description box below. Spirit messages, please, for Gemini. <clears throat> messages for Gemini. Um, Gemini, the first thing I am picking up is that things are going to start balancing out. What you have prayed for and what you have asked for will come to you. There is going to be a mutual understanding or there is going to be some type of understanding between you and another person. Okay, I see new beginnings. I see you stepping out on faith. You want something new. You're ready to embark on something new. You At one time, you felt like you had to defend yourself because I see a protective energy around you. Okay, external love. Okay, um, I feel like also there is someone that's coming in that wants to bring you and them together or some type of love situation that's going to it's like someone wants you <laughs> what the okay um somebody wants you um i feel like also someone looks at you like the end all be all wow. okay here what else please for gemini <laughs> we have concerned so I feel like you're right now trying to figure out what you want or how you want to go about something, okay? You've been thinking about this. You've been rehashing. You're sitting here thinking about what is it do I want? Do I really want this? Is this something that I truly want? Do I want to move forward with this, okay? Ego. So I feel like someone stands in their ego or they're very stubborn when it comes to certain things. But I feel like there may have been no movement or someone is repressing their emotions for you. Okay. But I feel like you may be concerned about something, something that you're holding within or something that you have not let out yet. Okay. Deep love. Yeah. Someone is truly in love with you, okay, or you're in love with someone, and they want to have a conversation, but I feel like they're hiding something here. And again, I see a stubborn energy, okay? I feel like someone is keeping everything to themselves and not really speaking or saying things that they want to say. Hmm. What else? Immature. So someone may be immature in the way that they love or how they show their love or attention or affection, okay? Um, but they love you very deeply here, but they're keeping things to themselves. They don't want to open up. We have a new passion. So I feel like something is going to unite within you or in this person where someone is going to feel like they're forced to come towards you or they're forced to um, speak with you. They need to talk. They need to um, say something. It's like they cannot hold it any longer here, um, Gemini. I need to say something. I need to talk to you. I'm concerned. My mind is going back and forth. It's, again, I see a stubborn energy and I see someone constantly thinking or rehashing things, wanting to talk. I feel like this love is so deep. This, it, It's almost like you, your mind is going or someone's mind is going. Again, I feel like someone is... Um, in your ego during this time and a little bit of immaturity. We have the Fool card and it says step into the unknown adventure, new beginning, free spirit, okay, leap of faith, okay? So I feel like you're taking on something new during this time, Gemini, and you're ready, you're ready to do something, but you're thinking about, okay, do I really want this? Is this something I want? How do I go about it? We have the three of pentacles, teamwork, collaboration, effort, shared goals, and growing. So um, expansion. So I feel like with this concern and this three of pentacles, you're concerned about, okay, how do I work on this? How do I make this grow? Why am I doing it? Why do I feel this way, right? So I feel like you're working on it's all in the mind. I keep hearing all in the mind. Like you're in your head during this time. You want to do this. You want to move forward. Um, you want to make certain moves or do certain things in a different way. We have the nine of swords. Again, like I said, you're in your mind a lot. You're thinking. Lack of sleep, anxiety, breaking point, mental anguish. So you're just thinking a lot. Again, in that ego, someone is 
um, a little stubborn, okay? We have the Five of, of Cups. Feeling um, a little bit heartbroken and isolated. Um, there may have been some type of change that caused you to be in your head a lot or for you, this person to be in their head a lot. Um, a little closed off as well here, okay? We have the Emperor and we have solid foundation stability, self-mastery, leadership. So you're stepping into something much stronger, much better, um, something that you truly want but it is causing anxiety it is causing it's almost like you feel almost like you need to pull back a little bit due to you're unsure of how to move forward or you you're unsure of something i'm hearing okay spirit what else please <clears throat> we have the ten of pentacles inheritance old money marry into money windfall business empire so you're moving into something that is more i feel like you're going to feel more free we have the two of swords but you're in between you're torn in between a decision you're torn in between something okay there's a deep love for your career for your um for some of you this could be a partner but I really feel like this is um, career. I don't know why I'm hearing career. Um, but I feel like you're torn between a decision of do you want to take advantage of this opportunity that's coming towards you? Okay. And, and, and just take a leap of faith. Or do you want to keep going the same way? Because it does say crossroads here, right? You're at a crossroads on... Are you walking into your Ten of Pentacles and your inheritance, what belongs to you, what you desire and what you deserve? Or are you going to stay still or are you going to keep going down the same path or make a, a different decision here? Mm -hmm. We have the Eight of Cups. You may be walking away, withdrawing, um, self-discovery, believing in yourself also. Spirit, what else please for Gemini? <clears throat> messages please for a gemini oh okay hmm. we have the magician okay manifestation concentration action resourceful power okay really finding things within yourself now the one thing also with this immature someone is turning back okay yeah we have the five of pentacles okay um a negative change struggle alone lack of mind lack mindset just because you have to do something on your own for a lot of you and this is not for everyone don't turn away don't feel like this okay because i feel like you have so much strength and power within you that sometimes you may feel like you may feel alone but you have your guides you have your ancestors they're with you and you are attracting a mutual partnership And I feel like you're walking away from whatever this immature energy was. Okay. <clears throat> now, it is that somebody may have deep feelings for you. But I feel like it was a little bit of an immaturity. And you're walking away from that. Like I said, you have stability. And you have a, a partnership that is coming in. But you're walking away from something that no longer serves you. That's something that made you feel lost, left out okay in dismay okay what else spirit please for gemini messages please for gemini the ace of wands new concept new idea finding the confidence within yourself feeling inspired that creative spark new energy a new passion is coming through with that full card right you're ready The Three of Wands, and we also have the Three of Pentacles. You're making a decision to move forward. You have chosen to grow. You have chosen to move forward. No more looking back. You're looking ahead. What else, Spirit, please? Look at that. 
the six of cups i feel like in with the six of cups in reverse you're no longer having to um go through this energy you're no longer looking at the past you're no longer having to heal from the past you are ready to move forward we have the five of swords whatever was betraying you or happened in your past i feel like you are releasing this okay um i feel like there was a lot of stress anger conflict that is being released you're looking at it and you're looking at it to me in the reverse. So it's not there anymore. You're letting it go. You're ready to only can be concerned about self during this time with the nine of pentacles. Growing your empire. This nine of pentacles is looking at this knight of cups. What are you about to offer me? What can you give me that I don't already have? <clears throat> Spirit, what else, please? We have the strength card. Overcoming any kind of self-doubt. Finding the confidence within yourself to overcome anything. Calming that beast within yourself also, okay? And we also have justice. The scales are going to be balanced or things are going to balance out for you here. And... <clears throat> I feel like there is a coming together, some type of partnership, okay? We have the Four of Wands again. Where is it? I know I've seen it. Yeah, the Four of Wands and the Four of Wands. Celebration, happiness, joy, commitment, coming together. Something that's deeper. Something that reunites the soul. But you're leaving behind the things that no longer serve you. A tower moment along with... So something's happened unexpectedly. We have the emperor again. Okay. And we also have the ten of cups. So something is going to come out of nowhere. Someone has been concerned and watching you. But they're deeply in love with you here, Gemini. Okay. But someone from the past, I really feel like that energy is immature. Someone from the past. Or someone is hiding their emotions for you okay and they've been hiding it for a while but they're ready to open up and come out and take a leap of faith towards you okay um and this could be you ready to take a leap of faith towards someone but someone is ready to break the odds here and come into something new with the magician we have the magician twice okay so someone is ready to have a happy ever after with you, celebrate, come together, break down that ego, that stubbornness, whatever was keeping them from moving forward. And that ego can also cause immaturity as well. Okay. And I feel like there is going to be a lot of changes that is happening around you here. And there is a decision that is being made. Okay. And is going to bring you into what belongs to you. Okay. So thank you so much, Gemini. Please like and subscribe and I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.